If the elevator opens, it arrives, it opens, nobody's there but there's a suitcase on the ground, and then it closes, and then it opens and there's a man there who wasn't there two <laughs> seconds ago holding the suitcase, and he walks out onto your floor. That would scare the shit out of me. Hey everybody, welcome back. We are going into the casino level now. We're going into casino nights. Uh, this mission, I have probably the funniest kill in the game, and I'm really proud of this one. I'm sure I'm not the first guy to come up with this one, but I've never seen anyone else do it. It's not the most efficient way, but it's fucking funny, and I never get caught. Uh, so we need to kill the Sheik guy, we need to kill this scientist with a very confusing name, and we need to kill the white supremacist from South Africa. We can also optionally run away with uh, some blood diamonds, gets us some more money. So we just need our silver baller. In fact, I don't think I even use the silver baller, but I guess I'll bring it. Silencer level two. So we have all of the gear uh, unlocked now. So that's the quietest silencer. And I don't remember if I actually want the scope or not. I think I'm cool with what I've got. And then miscellaneous equipment, flexible flak vest. I take 35% less damage and it doesn't get lost with changing outfit. Uh, mm. Which is why I never bought the previous armor. All right, so we've got the best equipment in the game that we actually want for now. I believe I might buy the foil padded suitcase for the final mission. I don't remember how I do the final mission very well. All right, so I might fuck Whoa. this up immediately. Uh, we'll figure it. We'll, we'll see. Um, oh my god, $630,000. Whoa! All right, uh, so I can actually do this faster if I skip this cutscene, but I'm not going to the first time, at least so you get to see it. I have a reservation. The name is Kropes. Let's see. There it is. Here's your key card. Our new key cards are floor specific, so they only give you access to the floor you're staying on. That's fine. Alrighty then. On behalf of Shamal Hotel and Casino, let me be the first to wish you a very pleasant stay, Dr. Kropes. Yeah, so if you're wondering why the audio's fucked there, I don't know. She's a robot. All right, I believe it's this elevator that I want to do first. Dr. Cropes? It sounds like Dr. Gropes. I think it's supposed to sound like Corpse. Sounds like Gropes. You know, all of his names are like that. Like, usually goes by Tobias Reaper and stuff. Okay, uh, I just want to close. I want the door to close. Close faster. I think this is the correct elevator first. You can already see what I'm going for. Okay. So down there, is that the, the she coming up first? No, that's the scientist coming up first. He is my first target, right? Yeah, and then that's the sheik. And the white supremacist hasn't shown up yet. Hmm. All right. So you know how I told you before, there's a lot of waiting in this one. We're going to watch that little power symbol move around. I've got to wait for this guy to come to the elevator. He's so slow, though. And I have to hope I went in the right elevator, because I don't remember which one it is. I made an educated guess based on my memory, which might not be super accurate. Because, again, I practiced the ending few maps, uh, like, month, two months ago. Probably mm. I practiced them last, actually, right before you moved base because I, we weren't sure what your internet situation was going to be. So that's like two and a half months ago now. Yep. Um, and I haven't done this mission since then. All right, it looks, looks like, like he's coming right to the though. right one. He just turns like... It, I swear to right God. Right at the he... doorway. Okay. Got my fiber wire, and I got to wait for the door to close. There we go. go so we get his key card so we're allowed on the eighth floor not just uh, the seventh floor i gotta wait until i hear the door close because you want to drop from the ceiling when the door's open because there's a guard right there so i can pick up the payment briefcase which it itself is an optional quest you can see there um i'm gonna just open the door oh hey look it was open a second ago and then a guy appeared <laughs> with a suitcase you just saw laying on the ground Huh, funny how that happens. Oh, right, I uh, I actually need to go down a floor. Okay, bye. All right, I'm going to go to my room now. Hi. Uh, which I believe is right over here. I actually have a that little bit of time me. here. 
I believe this one's my room. There we go. That so would scare I, me. Like, what? completely. If I walked into the elevator, there's a dude standing there staring right at me. It's, like, that well, would freak if, me out. If, if, the, if the elevator opens, it arrives, it opens, nobody's there, but there's a suitcase on the ground, and then it closes. And then it opens, and there's a man there who wasn't there two <laughs> seconds ago holding the suitcase, and he walks out onto your floor. That would scare the shit out of me. No, um, no, I'm just saying, like, I'm just saying, like, as like, if the security guard was just standing there looking right at me. Oh yeah, that would also unsettle me. Uh, he's there just because he magically knows if you have the right key card or not. All right, so I'm just calling the other elevator now. I don't know why there yeah. are lasers being shot in this song. What? Oh yeah. <laughs> I didn't even think. I didn't it's even cannibal hear that holocaust. No, those were more like pew 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 pew. pew. God, that's old school. All right, I uh, climb yep. in the hatch of the other elevator. The other guy's gonna get in this elevator. Yes, in probably oh, five full minutes. Oh yay! Do I cast five a shadow? Full. I do cast Full a little minutes. bit of a shadow. That's pretty cool. All right. Oh, God. And now we play the waiting game. You have no actual nostrils. That's the Sheik arriving. So the Sheik is going to uh. go to a private. Yeah, he kind of clicked through the door. The Sheik there is going to go to a private booth. Um... He's going to be going to a private booth in the casino where I'm not allowed in. Now, if I dress as the white supremacist, then I'm allowed in because he doesn't know what the white supremacist looks like. He just knows he has a meeting with him. Hmm. Then how so that's, the, why the fuck do you have to dress as him then? I don't know. I guess he, he was told what he'll look like. He's got a silenced pistol on him. Yeah, Heinrich Schmutz. Is his name. Okay, I'm gonna wait for the door to open, then wait for it to close. There we go. Uh, I'm trying to remember. I think there's an incentive for me to go to his room, so it's over there. Uh, is that this way? Yeah. So now I can basically take as long as I want if I were to want to. Um, I don't really need to be quick anymore. There's no elevators or like special things I need to catch. The guy is going to go to his booth, and he's going to wait there until the end of time. Huh. So what I want is the DNA briefcase. Um, yeah, so I don't need this. I don't believe I actually need this. Yeah, this is a suitcase he was going to come up and get and then bring to the meeting. You need this for the meeting. Instead, I'm going to put a mine in it. There we go. Uh, that's that's the action of putting a mine in something, apparently. Just All right. reaching into your jacket? Uh, yeah, just reach into the jacket, and then a mine gets teleported out of your hand into the suitcase. Um, okay. It's still better than one of my wackier kills uh, from Till Death Do Us Part, the previous map. Oh, wrong way. Um, is I, I get, and I steal an invitation to the party. I go into the party, I steal a present, which is just like a box with like a bow on top. I put a landmine in it, which actually is just stick, stuck to the outside of it and no one notices. I drop it in the middle of the front foyer, walk away, and then watch the map until he's standing on it and blow it up. That's that's another way that you can do that map, but it's slower and there's probably going to be collateral damage. Huh. Alright, so there's a very small chance I fuck this up. And we'll have to do it again? Now, I probably won't get close. seen... Uh, you don't need to for what I'm doing. Now, I can avoid a camera here if I'm careful. There's a camera right there. Is that going to see me? Okay, I think I avoided it. It's not a huge deal if the camera sees me, but yeah, it's preferable if it doesn't. Okay, he is immediately on the other side of that. You're so just everyone's just going to watch me do that. <laughs> Whoop, not, not a landmine. Not a landmine. Hope I didn't fuck that up. Uh, they saw me pull out a landmine. Uh, that was literally, I misclicked right at the end. I meant to pull the detonator, which they magically can't see. I pulled a landmine and everyone watched me do it. Damn it. Let's, we'll just fast forward to where, to the next, uh, to, to where I was.
Last guy to kill now. All right, all right. Let's let's not fuck this up this time. I died due to the stupidest little misclick on my part. All right. Yeah, pull this mine out. Oh. Yeah. Now they don't they don't see the detonator, but they see the mine. All right. Well, the detonator's a little smaller. And. Whoop. Whoop. I probably should have checked to make sure he was there, but I've never had him not be there. There we go. And it killed him. Now we just go get the diamonds and we go. There we go. And I went under the camera so it didn't see me. Now, if you get seen by the camera, it doesn't actually matter. That guy was mysteriously running around. Uh, which, which elevator is this? This one? Mm, just to make me feel a little safer. I don't think it's gonna matter because they, I didn't even catch me. Like, it's a full red exclamation point, but again, as we've seen before in other maps, it's not always accurate. That's true. Yeah. Wow, the music has gotten so fucking loud all of a sudden. We'll lose like a 5,000 bucks on not getting our suit. Uh, you Pretty know what? Well. I am going to wear the suit. I was going to say, you it. could just get it. Yeah, no reason not to, I guess. I'm pretty confident that I'm in the clear. Oh, I took a little damage there. Why? What? Oh, I... probably because the elevator was going down and you jumped down into it? Ah, uh, yeah. Okay, you can get seen by a camera on your way out, and it's a bit of a pain, but I think overall I did pretty well. There we go. Now, why people can't put two and two together that a man walked in and hurled a briefcase over a divider, and then the briefcase exploded that perhaps the man is the bomber, I don't know. Because there were a shitload of witnesses to- No, witnesses yes. right there, witnesses zero. A ton of people saw me throw the suitcase, but they can't seem to put two and two together. There we go, ghost. Your rating, the ghost, zero notoriety. <laughs> what the fuck? A little violent for a ghost, though. The ghost kills again. That's oh horrible. my god. Oh, election poll. Oh, hold on. Here we go. Wait, this has newspaper adverts for this. Okay, the heaven and hell party. That's the next level. Election poll. Frank Morgan. Mm, mm, Tom Stewart doing really well. All right, let's uh, we'll save. We're going on to, I believe, the second last map. It's over 47. I'm closing shop at this end. This will be your last assignment. There are two targets. Varna Ketlin, a former Romanian circus performer who's now a big player in the global gray market and a CIA operative who's been playing both sides of the fence. Ketlin's hosting a masquerade party at the Shark Club in Vegas, and the CIA op will be there to close a deal. Even if this job isn't a setup, your presence will almost definitely be expected. You're our only surviving agent, 47. Find out whoever it is that's been coming after us. Eliminate both targets, and anyone that targets you, and exit in the vehicle I'll have ready for you in the parking garage. You've been a very effective agent. It's been pleasant to work with you. I hope the future is kind to you. No, oh, shut up. Next episode, we go into the second uh, from last, like, proper full-on map of the game. Uh, I remember what I'm doing pretty well in it. I don't remember the exact pathing, but I, uh, I again, I, I squeezed in a little bit of practice earlier today real quick while you were getting ready. Until next time, have a nice day. See ya.